everyone, it's Jordan. Today, as you can tell, I'm wearing my mini ears and my pin lanyards. I'm going to be showing you guys my Dizzy Pins collection. Before I sh show you all my pins collection, leave in a comment. Well, I don't. I want you to guess how many pins I've collected, and I'm going to um, say how many pins I've collected at the end of this video. And I honestly have been into pin coll di collecting Dizzy Pins since I was six years old and I just love collecting because they're all unique in every way. My sister, my sister actually started with me. That was something that we started together because we've that's what we do as sisters. There were some pins that we traded with each other just because we know it's something that we like and in, in my next Disney trip I'm hoping to do some pin train because I love I want I regret not doing pin train because of I saw a bell pin that I wanted and I didn't get it but let's get started so this is my pin board that I literally bought a few days ago and starting from the top is all the Tinkerbell pins and Peter Pan related pins this pin was my very first pin which I'm really happy about and these are my Tinkerbell pins these four are from a booster set that my parents got me for Christmas like several years ago and this Tinkerbell pin was the pin that Kevin's parents got me and I also love this mini pin where she dresses like Tinkerbell and this is also one of my favorites that I got when I was 10 and it's a Tinkerbell pin, obviously, that she says just chilling. This is one of my favorites. And this one is just a, has Tinkerbell with Magic Kingdom 70, not 75th, excuse me, um, 45th anniversary for the Magic Kingdom. I really like it. And of course, these two are from different mystery pin sets. This is from the donut one, and I was so happy that I got Tinkerbell. This is from just, you know, um, Disney World. I, and I'm happy that I got Tinkerbell. I have another pin that's from that I'll show you in a few seconds. And, of course, um, I also had to get this pin because it has my birthday month, which is July. And this is a giant pin key thing, which is really pretty. This one is from another pin set that's just pure pin related and has Tinkerbell that's just fell over um, I don't know what it's called what has a thing with um, thread on it and there's um, a Tinkerbell Zoom Zoom that I got from Amazon just because I want it but I want to get all the Zoom Zoom sets and this pin right here it, the next Tinkerbell pin next to it is from the Nesting Dolls which I also bought from Amazon and this one I literally just got like a couple weeks ago of Tinkerbell dressing up like a pirate and I just needed this pin. And then there's one of Peter Pan and Tinkerbell from the Disney's Couples Collection which I do not understand how they're a couple because I consider Peter Pan and Wendy a couple. <laughs> and then I have these two Peter Pan hats. I know it's strange to have two Peter Pan hats. One's from the Disney, um, Disney Hats mystery collection and I'm happy that I got Peter Pan. I just need Captain Hook's hat and then the other ones from the booster set. <laughs> and this Peter Pan pin right here was the very first Peter Pan pin that I got and he he and Tink that's the only Peter Pan pin that I have but I want to collect more of it. And then there's Captain Hook which I just got um, the last Disney trip where he's the only Captain Hook um, pin that I have. That I don't know why I didn't start collecting villains pins until the last trip. And then I have this um, flying ship that was from the booster set that I just mentioned earlier with Tinkerbell. This one, yes, that is the um, Disney World Castle. On it. it used to have Tinkerbell on a spring, but sadly she broke off, but I kept the pin anyway, whether it has Tinkerbell on it or not. And then I have this um, ball cap pin of Tinkerbell because I got it from a set which is um, another one that I got and I just love this pin. 
this is another um, Peter Pan related pin that has Michael's teddy bear tied up on the Indians arrow and I just love the Peter Pan set and these three Tinkerbell pins this one is one of my favorites because my parents got me that and plus it has Cinderella Castle in the background this one, I actually got this from a Disney outlet that is by Disney World, and I was like, it's a Tinkerbell pin, I just want it. And this one, it it says all about me, with, and Tinkerbell is being sassy, and I really like it. Moving right along, I have some Beauty and Beast pins as well, and I have Belle and Beast um, from the Disney's Couple set. I literally bought the Peter Pan one that is above it from... Amazon and then this one is my very first bell pin which I'm really happy about just not just because it's owned by just one a bell pin and that was one of the first few pins in my collection and then I have the um, enchanted rose that I got on my last trip which I really wanted and I know I wanted the one that says beauty's beauty is found within but I didn't but I got this one instead this is my very uh, my favorite bell pin just because she's reading a book and I can relate to that. <laughs> and then I've got Vina Beast Zoom Zoom pins. That's one of the mystery pins that I just kept buying at Disney World. And you have all the characters, well, almost all the characters from Vina Beast. You have Belle, Beast, Lumiere, Cosworth, Maurice, Gaston. LeFou, Chip, and Mrs. Potts. And then this nesting doll pin was another one that I bought from Amazon just because she's my favorite and I didn't get it from the nesting doll mystery set. And then I have mini um, Lilo and Stitch pins because it's my number three favorite Disney movie of all time. I have Lilo and Stitch from the Best Friends collection which I'm happy about and I want to collect more of these pins and then I have Stitch dressed as Elvis just because I want something that relates to my grandma because she loves Elvis and I love Lilo and Stitch and he's just so cute in his Elvis outfit and then I got this hidden Mickey's Stitch that I got from a pin lot and I know everybody's like stay away from those because they're scrappers but I've had no problems with the pin lot so far, and plus I did not have the stitch because he's really cute. And of course I got these two um, emoji stitch from the pin lots as well, and they're um, different emojis of stitch. This one's my favorite just because he's being silly stitch. And then I have three frozen pins because it's also one of my favorite Disney films. I got this from Amazon and it's just... Elsa with Anna just because I love my sister so much that's why I love the movie is the sisterhood and I just had to get this pin and then I got this Elsa pin because I met her at Epcot the last Disney trip and I know I need Anna to complete my Frozen um, collection and then I have Olaf because I bought bomb the last Disney trip but I didn't the, the previous one so I just need to get them and then the rest of my boards is just miscellaneous. So I have Mickey here and I have Happy from the Disney's Grin Mystery Collection. And I just found out that it's a chaser, which is really cool. And then I have Piglet um, from the hidden Mickey set with Mickey ears. And he's really cute. <laughs> and then I have Mr. Potato Head as the movie's director I got from the mystery set that features him and I just decided to get those pins because of the original voice of him just passed away re recently and I just thought I need something to remember him by. And then the next few pins I have Rapunzel with the lanterns. I wish it, oh there is Pascal there. I just didn't see him there. And then I have, I don't know which Dalmatian puppy it is. I know it's probably Lucky and it's in a donut farm. And then I have the Mary Poppins pin, just because I like Mary Poppins, and I met her in this exact outfit in one of the Disney trips. And then I have Kronk, just because he's one of my favorite characters from Amber's New Groove, plus he makes me laugh every time. And then I have um, the 
um, 45th anniversary Magic Kingdom pen that's just Cinderella's Castle, which I really like. And then I have Mushu, one of the hidden Mickeys, because you can see a tiny Mickey symbol there. And I got him from that set, and I was happy about it because I don't have any Mushu pens. <laughs> and then I have Tramp and Lee from the Disney Couple collection. I bought the extra one to trade out, but I gave it to my mom because I'm pretty because I knew that she probably wanted it. <laughs> The next pins I have is the pin from Up, which I also like the movie. I just need to have it, plus it'll be really cool to have it like Russell did at the end of the movie. And then I have Todd and Copper from um, The Fox and the Hound, which is from the Best Friends mystery set. And, the, and I love The Fox and the Hound. I mean, I love all the Disney movies equally because... Because I and I know I have favorites, but I love all the Disney movies. And this is my favorite Mickey pin because he's wearing a pin lanyard with it. I know it's really hard to see, but it's really cute with all the pin lanyards that he's wearing. The next few pins I have Mickey um, in a donut form from a Mr. Donut collection. And then I have one of the Disney Resorts pins at All Stars mm -hmm. Resorts. I actually stayed in two of them movie and um sports i didn't stay in music but i really want to and then i have this ariel pin in her mermaid form i just want to get because i don't have any ariel pins at the time <laughs> the next few pins i actually have um the evil queen and um well not e evil queen um queen and king of hearts from the this is couple collection i've mentioned and i also want to collect more of these and then I have Mary Poppins in a nest in a nesting doll form from the nesting doll collection. Same as Rapunzel, you can tell with the Pascal and her long hair. And then I have the Expedition Everest pin because I've written on it a bunch of times from my last Disney trips. And the next few ones you've got here is Mickey flying on. Dumbo. Oh, there's Pluto there. And I know it's really hard to see because of my shadow. I'm sorry. Um, this is one of the Magic Kingdom pins. My sister actually accidentally bought herself an, um, two of them, so she gave one to me because it has Dumbo on it. And that's her favorite Disney character. And then I have Cinderella from the Nesting Doll Collection. I definitely want to collect more because it has all the ca other characters that I don't have in any pin form, so I want to collect more of them. And then I have the um, dopey pin as a stamp. I wanted to get Captain Hook from it, but I'm hoping to get him when I trade pins. And plus, I don't have a dopey pin because he's plus he's really cu cute. <laughs> and then I have the Chip and Dale one as from the 40th anniversary, I think, of the Magic Kingdom Hidden Mickey collection. So I just have it. I just decided to keep them because I don't have any Chip and Dale pins. <laughs> And the next one, I have Winnie the Pooh from the Best Friends pin collection. And I love Winnie the Pooh, so I'm like, I can't say no to that. And uh, Winnie the Pooh and Piglet, I should say. And then I have one of them making expression pins. Like, I know he looks like he's yelling, but I didn't care about his expressions. I just want at least one or two of them. And then I have Thor with the um, Avengers symbol on it. He's the only Marvel pins I have in my collection right now, so... And plus, he's one of my favorites. I wish they have Spider-Man of it, because I love Spider-Man. <laughs> and the next few pins, I have the nesting doll of Merida. And I'm again, I want to collect more of these. And then I have one of the Mickey Expressions. That's the one that is green. I showed you that I have an orange one. And, and I think I have a blue one on the board. I'm not quite sure. Yeah, he's somewhere on the board. And then I have Aurora and Philip, and uh, um, the Disney Couples collection. And then I have Figment, and I didn't know who he was at the time, and now I know his name. His name is Figment from the Hidden Mickey collection. And the next few pins here, I have the two Condor vultures from. I know it's one of the Hidden Mickey ones that looks like a badge, and as you can see, it's a. And that's also from the pin lot, and I've checked, it's not fake. And I, again, I mentioned my video, I don't care about the fakes, I just love collecting pins. So, 
and yeah. And then I have another Merida, just her regular form, and she's also, I just love her, because she's really outgoing, and I just, I love all the Disney princesses, to be honest. And then I have Jasmine Puzzle Pin. I, I was giving Kevin this from my trip, but he didn't get Jeannie. He got Jasmine, so I end up buying it. Jeannie won from Amazon or eBay to give him that, so I kept Jasmine. And it's the puzzle collection of Aladdin. And then I got this pin here that is actually from Tokyo Disneyland, which is really cool. And that's also from the plant pin lot. Again, I will show you the one I give Kevin in a minute. So, yeah, and I really like it. And it's many with um, one of the villain's crowns. I can't tell, but it's a really cool pin. And this is the blue one that I was mentioned earlier. And, yeah, and he just looks like a really happy mouse. <laughs> and then I have the Aurora nesting doll. And, and it's, I love the nesting doll pins. They're really re unique. And I want to collect more of these. And then we have Mickey with Pluto. And, yes, and their best friends. And I just love his pins so much. So, yeah, and I also want to collect more of the Best Friends one because I, I know they have the one with Woody and Buzz and Mike and Sully, and I love those characters. Next ones I have on the Seven Dwarfs Mind Train. This is from the Mystery Pins Collection for the 75th, and a, not 75th, um, 45th, 45th. <laughs> Slow down, Jordan. Um, anyway, this is from the, the that Mystery Pin Collection. I had the... Um, the Han Mansion ride, but I gave it to my sister, so, because she trained me with one of her grands one that was f happy from earlier. I just thought it makes sense to get happy because of the Seven Dwarves. And then I have, um, Colonel Jr. from, um, the Jungle Book, and I know it looks weird because he doesn't have eyes, but this is from the cast members tag collection, I think. So, yeah, I know it looks weird weird. I just thought it's a unique pen. Then I have Mickey as Steamboat Willie. I just needed a pen of him as Steamboat Willie because that's one of my favorite Mickey cartoons. And then I have this hint Mickey symbol pen. I don't know where it's from. I think it's from one of the Epcot collection. I just think it's really cool and I like it. And then I have Bambi because I don't have a Bambi pen and I love Bambi. And then I have Pinocchio's hat that's from the hat collection, which I want to collect more of because it's really cool. And the next one is um, Merida in a cute form. I did not know it, this um, pin set existed, but I want the rest of the Disney princesses in cute size, especially Belle because she's my fave and I love all the Disney princesses like I mentioned. The next few pins here, I have Animal Kingdom, just a simple Animal Kingdom pin with all the animals and a tree of life in the background. And then I have this Mickey from um, Tower of Terror uniform, and I've never been on this ride. Spoiler alert, I, I've never been on there, and I'm scared to go on. Yeah, and there's a hidden Mickey on it. And then I have Marie, because she's one of my favorite um, char um, Disney characters, and I've met her one of the previous strips and I just needed to get this pen. Next few in this bottom I have Dumbo because my sister accidentally bought herself one so she gave it to me. And then I have this Mickey one which is from Shanghai Disney I think. I know I have some from Hong Kong or Shanghai which is really cool and, and I want to collect more of these and this is a really cute Mickey pen. And then I have this Test Track mascot pin and that those pins are really cool especially that represents different Disney rides and I've got that from the mascots collection for Disney World because I've never been to Disneyland <laughs> and then I have Donald's um, 2017 collection because I was there last year and I just needed this pin I they have Peter Pan that's why I bought it but I didn't care to get others because I love them so and Donald's cute and I love the constellations in the background and then I have another uh, Mickey, which he looks mad, but again, I just 
want to at least feel the, his expression pins because I think with the colors it's really pretty. And then I have this Mickey symbol from, um, it's from the um, Animal Kingdom, I think. I just love the design, the patterns and everything, and it's really pretty. And then I have this other um, mascot pins, and I think it's from Toy Story Media. Yeah, it says Midway Maniac, so it's from that ride, and it's really cool. And then I have Shelly Mae, and... And I just discovered who she is, and her name is Shelly Mae, and I definitely want to collect the characters from the Asian parks as well. And then I have Snow White and the Prince from a Disney Couples Mystery Pen Collection. Then I have the Evil Queen, not the Evil Queen, the Queen of Hearts. Oh my gosh, there's so many villains that has Queen in the title, <laughs> to be honest. And I have the Queen of Hearts crown from the hat collection. And then I have the Hidden Mickey Caramel Apple of Goofy, and I gave an extra one to my mom when I did a pin lots because she loves Goofy. Again, I've checked, not a fake. <laughs> and then I have the comic books with Disney Valens collection. I want Captain Hook so badly. And then there's um, Queen of Hearts saying off with her head. It, I just love the design of it. It's really cool. And then the next... One here, I have Alice in her in a donut form, and then I have Br'er Rabbit from a pin quest, which I did not know existed until I saw this pin, and I was like, I wonder what it is. So I googled it, and I'm really interested in doing that. And then I have this scar one saying, "No fool, we are going to kill him," and Simba too, which is another comic book villain pin collection. And then I have. Before I get to the Star Wars, I have another Mr. Potato Head from the Mystery Collection, and he's the Sheriff, I think, but he really looks, looks like he's a Sheriff of some time. And then I have this pen. I know you can't see really well. Here we go. You kind of see it. This is from, this is the rooster from Robin Hood. I think his name is Alan. Kevin would correct me right now, because um, he would get mad at me if I don't remember his name. All I know his name is... Alan, I think. And then I have this Donald mug pen that is another, another hidden Mickey. And it's really cool that they made them in a mug form. And then I have the Mad Hatter pen that I got from the hat collection. And then I have some Star Wars Zoom Zooms here. And I want to collect Star Wars Zoom Zooms as well because I love Disney Zoom Zooms, especially Star Wars. I, I know that's Darth Vader. I know this is Chewbacca. I just got this from the pin lot and I know that's Yoda and this is the stormtrooper I don't know who these characters are I always forget plus I can't pronounce the species of aliens are called and then I have these characters in snowflakes form which is really cool this is R2-D2 and C-3PO and the and I want to collect more of these because those are really cool and I'm going to show you some of the Disney pins I have on some of my lanyards that are left over. And I, ha I have this, another mascot one from Big Thunder Mountain, and it's, boom, I know it's really hard to see. There we go. It's the line is kind of bad, and I apologize for that. And then I have Daisy Bow, that's from the hat collection. And then I have Ariel and Flounder, that's from the Best Friends Collection, and I love Ariel and Flounder. And I have Mike and Sully as ice cream, and this is from Hong Kong, I think. And I, I was like, I need the rest, because I think it's really cool in Zoom Zoom form, even though I saw one with Marie and the Green Aliens from Toy Story, which makes no sense to me at all, but I don't care. I want to collect them all. And then I have Kane Train in Zoom Zoom form. I need the... Um, collect the rest because I love Zim Zim's form like I mentioned and then I have Elliot in the um, ball cap form because there's not a lot of Elliot um, pins from Peach Dragon that's where he's from I want more Elliot because I love that dragon so much and then I have the seven dwarves mascot which is really cool because it has all the seven dwarves on the mine cards and it looks like they're ready to fight which I really like and then I have the, um, the mascots from Animal Kingdom, and it's Rebel, so um, 
Savannah Rabble. Yeah, that's what it said. And then I have Simba from the Green Collection, and that's the one that I bought. And when I got Dumbo, I decided to give it to my sister because, again, she loves Dumbo. And then I have the Evil Queen Zoom Zoom, which is from the Phil and Zoom Zoom co Collection, which I really need the rest because I want it. And I give one to Kevin, which is Jafar as a genie form, which I'll show you in a few cl clips. So, yeah. And and then I've got Figaro. I love Figaro. He's in a Zoom Zoom form. He's so cute. And I just need the rest of the Zoom Zooms because I love them so much and they're really cute <laughs> plus figaro reminds me of my own cat sazi because he's black and white and my family um my dad called him figaro when we first got him because he looks like him and then i have robin hood because robin hood is one of my favorite disney movies i don't know in what <laughs> number because i just love all the disney movies like i mentioned and i need a robin hood pin <laughs> And another lanyard, and yes, it's on a Harry Potter lanyard. Yeah, I know it makes no sense, but I've got a goofy donut, which is from the mystery pen as Disney characters in donut form, like I mentioned. And then I have Grumpy from the 2017 one, which I'm like, I don't care. I love the characters anyway. And then I have Dr. Facilier in Zoom Zoom form, which he's really cute, even though he's evil. And then I have the Sully um, Pin Train Fun Day, which is also Chaser, which I'm really excited to have Chasers. And this is also from Hong Kong or Shanghai from the lot. And again, like I mentioned a few times in this video, I don't care about fakes, but I've checked every pin style on the, that I got from lots were real. I've done everything that people say that they're fakes. And then I have Corella DeVille Zoom Zoom because... Again, I got it from the mystery pack, and I need more of these. <laughs> and so, this is the pin that I gave Kevin. This is the extra one that I got that I'm going to be trying out. And it's also from Hong Kong, and you can see that it looks like they're in at Mickey's and Agrabah with the genie's lamp, and that's why I gave it to him. So that is all for my Dizzy Pins collection, and like I mentioned, I'm going to mention how many pins that I've collected. You're probably going to guess it's a at least 50 or 100. I've collected 146 Disney pins and I did not know I collected that many. I know the last time I've counted it was like around 75 but I just love collecting Disney pins and you guys know I'm a big Disney fan and this is a big surprise to you that how much I love Disney especially when I have my own pin board finally and and I'm gonna collect more Disney pins because I love to do that's one of my hobbies besides um, reading and writing, like I don't consider reading and writing a hobby because that's what I love to do, but I also love collecting Disney pins and I can't wait for my next Disney trip because I'm going to be pin training for the first time. I'm nervous but excited at the same time. And if you enjoyed this video, give us a thumbs up and comment down below one of the coolest pins that I have in my collection that you think is the coolest, I think. I love all my pins and I'm proud that I'm a pin, Disney pin collector because one, I love Disney and two, a lot of these pins are really cool especially from the mystery pin packs because I want to try a lot of them but it's really hard to pick which one I want to do. Also, leave me in the comments down below if you want me to open up the mystery pin packs if you guys are curious. I might only do them in reading vlogs just because I don't know <laughs> if I want to do them in separate videos, like I know I want to talk about Disney on my channel besides books, but I want my channel to be mostly about books and I would just talk about Disney once in a while, but let me know in the comments down below if you're interested in that, and if you want to follow me on social media, I have Facebook on our last reader, and I have Twitter and Instagram on last reader 19 I also have Goodreach, which I'll link down below. If you don't want to miss any of my new videos, hit subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!